course, this rivalry has brought lots of people to Tuscaloosa, Alabama, Penn State. That is a history matchup. And Penn State fans really have traveled here in droves to watch their team and Alabama match up tomorrow in Bryant-Denny. Of course, the Penn State football tradition is rich. Our Sarah Killian caught up with some of those Penn State fans in Tuscaloosa. She continues our coverage of this big football weekend in Tuscaloosa. For these Penn State fans, it's their first time in Tuscaloosa, and there's no lack of excitement. An opportunity to see two class programs play early in the season. And as far as treatment from the Tide fans, so far, so good. Everybody's been very gracious. They really have. They, they, they've, most people have gone out of their way to welcome us, uh, whether it be uh, going into a store or a bar or just on the street. We've been uh, welcomed to Tuscaloosa by like every fifth or seventh person. Welcome to Tuscaloosa. Welcome to Alabama. However, there has been a few exceptions. Some of the male students, when they're in cars and driving by, they, they wave to us with one of their fingers. These Penn State fans say the respect surrounding this classic matchup goes back to two men. Bear Bryant and Joe Paterno had such a long history with wins, and Joe Pa just passed him here this last year with a number of victories all time. But Bear's been gone for a while, but it's, they're just both storied programs. And these guys even found some similarities between Tide and Penn State fans. They both like football. <laughs> A lot. Reporting in Tuscaloosa, Sarah Killian, <laughs> WVUA News.